have told me Nicolas Dufourque, donc CEO of uh, the BPI France and Antigone Liberopoulos, CEO of HDBI. You, uh, you can take uh, the HDBI also a microphone. You started a collaboration in 2019 together, I mean HDBI and BPI France, uh, a European collaboration, a very strong collaboration, and uh, there's a result also, bravo Antigone. And you signed up an MOU for GP acceleration now, as I see Antigone. What is it all about and how crucial it is? Okay, just a few words on the past. We've met BPI like 12 years ago when we start uh, and established the EFIN, the European Fund Investors Network, which was informal but very useful and we gained a lot of experience and know-how. Then we had the assistance of BPI as technical advisor to the transformation of the organization. In two, uh, 2019, indeed, the first contract to, for BPI to act as investment advisor and helped us a lot in the due diligence assessment of the fund managers. We are still have an ongoing contract, and now, since we have to grow together and we have to grow all the ingredients of this market together and the fund managers, we came up with the idea that since in BPI there is a GP accelerator, a service that will boost the performance, the networking of the fund managers, it is essential that we have it here. Now that we are growing the equity market and the fund management market, it's good to have the support of an experienced player, organization, institution, BPI, to help us develop these skills as well and to help develop our fund managers. So it is essential, it's very crucial, and thank you for your uh, continuous support. But the results are here. Your collaboration is uh, fruitful. I mean, you have, have, you have some uh, results, right? Of course. We have already, the last month, we have uh, uh, participated in uh, 12 new funds. Mm -hmm. And uh, the experience and support from BPI enable us to choose the best and to make the due diligence assessment as professional and as sound as possible. So this is this interaction that's ongoing because keep uh, things are changing, and we need to have um, to be in line with the progress and the developments. So we have a constant cooperation, and uh, we strongly believe in it, and uh, we will build further on it as well. Nicola, thank you for being here, and this this event also is a proof. Huh? It's a proof that we are going together and uh, we are uh, seeking opportunities to do more. Yes, as you organize the growing together also uh, with uh, uh, you, Nicola. Nicola, when you see the results of uh, Antigone, this, um, uh, this uh, way to um, help also uh, investors and funds who are hungry for deals, how do you see this uh, situation and this collaboration that you have no, together? No, but we, we are um, very strong believers of uh, the business of funds of funds. At BPI, it's massive now. Uh, we have 35 people working in funds of funds. Every year, we're investing 1.6 billion in funds. So uh, we, we have accumulated so many uh, uh, knowledge and experience in, in assessing the GPs that we are extremely happy to share it with you through our MOU. Huh? We uh, even have created in France a school for GPs huh? with a program which is lasting 18 months. It's uh, uh, this year, 2022, it's the fourth year we do that. And uh, practically all the French GPs have come through our schools because GPs are entrepreneurs like others and we want them to develop their platforms. Um, LPs like us and you uh, become more and more professional. It's a, you know, it's a recipe which is not easy to understand how to evaluate a GP. There is a secret sauce also. Huh? And uh, so there is a, there is a lot we, we have learned in the past years with our teams. So it's very good that we could share that with you. And then possibly there will be cross-border investments and so forth uh, that we will favor. So with uh, Antigone, with GBD, uh, HBI, we are, you are growing together, but uh, you said with the Prime Minister that you're starting in Athens. This is just a start of growing together, a European dream. Do you think you can do 
a European vision and maybe more events around Europe? Imagine a Europe in which we have um, funds of funds like us in 27 countries working together. Imagine that you have in Europe, let's say, 50 funds which are cross-border. Strong funds, huh? not, not uh, 100 million, billions. Imagine a Europe in which, as far as loans are concerned, you have uh, SME banks in 27 countries working together. Imagine a Europe in which you have a collaboration between the Exim banks. Imagine a Europe in which you have consulting teams working cross-border. I mean, it's a different Europe. So that's what we want to do. And uh, paradoxically, we think that the main obstacle is uh, essentially political. So this is what we have to crack. This, we did that in, in France 10 years ago. There was a major decision taken to merge everything in one hand. The consequences were humongous on the economy. So uh, I, can, I, 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 I don't hesitate to be an advocate of, of the model. You know, innovation financing, SME financing by loans, funds of funds, direct equity, branches on the field to talk to the customers, a social network of entrepreneurs, lots of events, Exim Bank, consulting, you know, uh, endeavoring the entrepreneurship through uh, company creation, working with universities, technology transfer, all that in one hand. That's what we have to do. That's a nice dream, a nice vision. Huh? Is it motivating for you also, Antigone? It is, it is. It is okay. a strategy that is needed. I mean, uh, I think this is the essence. You need a strategic positioning on how to promote innovation, entrepreneurship, business support, and so on and so forth. So we, we strongly believe that we have to have coordinated activities and actions. And um, we're looking forward to more events and to further elaborate on all these common principles of ours and common visions, because we do have a common vision on how to create a united Europe in practice. That will we will invite the Prime Minister to our major event in October. The big... Uh, uh, so, that, so that he sees the magnitude of uh, the volume yeah, the, yeah, of, yeah. of energy that is the consequence of that model. Actually, and uh, Mrs. Kefala is a witness, uh, during my interview in a TV set in Big, during yes. the last one, I said, I yes, was, she there, was here with and me. I said, we will bring Big to Greece. And you see, it's and a promise that came true. You see? <laughs> so that's why our collaboration is very important. Thank you, Antigone Liberopoulou. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you, you, Nicolas Dufort. Merci.